Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with another four box break of 21-22 Panini Donruss Optic Basketball. Four box, pick your team at number 11. Very big thanks to this group right here for making it happen. I guess we can turn the top camera off for this break. There we go. I right, appreciate everybody making this happen. Noel with Last Bot Mojo Sons, who says sometime in his life he wants to see a black label Michael Jordan Fleer rookie. Do those exist? Are there any out there in the wild? Maybe none sold. Are, doesn't PSA have those that, that information? All right, one, two, three for the league. You can see I, I, I've made those black X's on the left side right there, so we know they're from the same case. One, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. Two, three, four, five, six. And so we'll save this for break number, this is 11, break number 12. And as promised, So it will be X12 on here. It sounds like a, uh, a BMW model, an X12. I promise that if we, uh, if we sell this out straight up, I know we're kind of running out of time, but if we sell it out straight up by the end of our sort of scheduled evening, people dig deep and sell that out. I'm down to, uh, um, I'm down to do it. That final four box, we'll go over a little bit to make that happen. So. That offer is out there. All right. Thank you. Good luck, everybody. The fir first four boxes were pretty solid. I don't know if we saw a big rookie auto or anything like that, but, but it was a nice start. I like the optic. It's a nice, clean look. Uh, sharp design. They didn't really mess with it too much. Uh, in recent years, they added some some fun little parallels. The rated rookie hollows, always, uh, if, especially if it's the top rookies, and grade out nicely. If they do grade out nicely, they generally resell pretty well in the secondary market. So there's a lot to do, a lot of parallels to chase, a lot of fun things to hunt. No, Jason pulled that over the weekend, Brandon. That one of one, Scotty, Scotty Barnes, gold vinyl redemption. pretty nice. Hopefully uh, Panini can put the squeeze on Scotty Barnes and his team and be like, hey, do you mind, uh, mind selling, uh, signing those before the, you get busy with the season? That'd be nice. Where's that 30, Carl's asking? Damon Lillard, 37 out of 99. And there's a 75 year in the NBA, LeBron James, 2016. What about 2016, Carl? Raining threes, Buddy Heal. Oh, and these are going to be left-right randomizers on these, unless they're uh, unless they're numbered cards. It's Brooklyn Nets Kessler Edwards, rated rookie autograph. That'll be for Darren, Darren Y, and I think we got a Darren Y and a Darren P in this break. This is for Darren Y. That'll be for uh, the Nets once again. Got a Isaiah Todd to 79 for the Wizards. That'll be for Gordon. Yeah, come on, Justin. Well, I mean, to be fair, there are... There are training camps, and then there's the preseason, and I'm sure he's working out, and all that sort of stuff. 
But I feel like Justin Fields does have more time now than he generally would in the regular season, right? Why not sign some cards? Justin, there's a Scotty Barnes rated rookie card for Toronto. That'll be for Sean Maddock. And we've got a Jalen Johnson. That's two autographs in this box. There's only supposed to be one. Find one autograph. Per on average. This is an above average box. I wonder if that means one of these boxes will be below average. So Jalen Johnson, rated rookie autograph for Atlanta, Ryan Stewart. There's a Luca Garza. Joe Ingles to 199. A Josh Giddy rated rookie card. Sean Maddock and OKC. And a Jalen Suggs rated, uh, no, sorry, not a rated rookie, but the rookies. Insert for Orlando, that will be for Matthew. Nice, box one in the books. Box two. I hope, yeah, I hope Justin Fields has a good season. I think the early reports that it's, uh, you know, that he's, uh, they're cautiously optimistic. Next box. We got a 32 out of 49. We got a blue All Stars two player card. This will randomize separately. And Jaden Springer autographs, optographs. Thirty-six out of ninety-nine. Gordon with the Sixers. Yeah, Carl saying these cards are something. Yeah, they're pretty nice. Donner's Optic Basketball, one of the more popular releases of the year. Evan Mobley rated rookie. Lonnie Walker to 199. This is for Tebow and the Cavs. Maybe some hollow parallels will be nice. Maybe some lower numbers, some ink.
Jeremy Grant, 004 out of 149. Got a Kaminga, Patrick Williams. I will. The LeBron Zion. If it was numbered, I'd randomize it separately. If it's not, we'll do left right randomizers on those. Like we usually do. We've got a silver rated, or hollow actually. It's prism is silver and think hollow optic right here. That'll be for Matthew and Orlando. All right, third box. Halfway through this four box break. Cor correct, yeah. I mean, I'll do the left right, like, so I'll do the left right randomizer, and then the shipping team, I'll tell them, hey, all the left side cards get them. And they'll be like, okay, and they'll sort it out that way. But if it's numbered, yeah, we do those separately. Just so it saves us the trouble of randomizing like a dozen of those cards one by one. Carl, relax. You're not even a, a. You're not even in this break. B. A lot of people who got into this break are in, got into it because they're enjoying it. Relax. You know, be, be a little respectful to the people who bought into this break who are having a good time enjoying it. You're not going to love everything, every product you see out here. Not everyone's going to love every one of these. So just take a deep breath, relax. And we got a Davion Mitchell rated rookie hollow. Ryan Stewart with the Kings. Wendell Carter Jr., 6 out of 39. Another Jalen Suggs. And a Mono Ginobili, 59 out of 99. Optographs. That's going to be for Darren P. and the Spurs. Manu. 59 out of 99. Gordon Hayward, 20 out of 79. And THT, 156 out of 199. So the THT Lakers edition is going to Tebow. And the Gordon Hayward to 79 will be for Brian and Charlotte. Stop again in this 
Another Evan Mobley. I wish we saw some parallels here. It'd be nice. Jalen Green for Houston. It's going to be for Matthew. And the rookies, Evan Mobley. Yeah, I wish he gone, right? I wish THT would have worked out. So I was a little surprised. I was a little surprised that, I mean, after giving THT the Austin Caruso money, Alex Caruso money, sorry, Austin Caruso is one of our customers, uh, that they gave THT the Caruso money and they were pretty, they dug in on, hey, we don't want to, we don't want to trade him for, you know, whoever was available that could have been traded for. Uh, and then they're like, yeah, well, send him a line. Then I guess the relationship soured that quickly. I mean, he did regress last season, but I'm not sure if his style of play, you know, really worked with, with the roster that was constructed. Caruso actually fit well with the, with the roster that was constructed. Hmm. I mean, all the so-called experts seem to think that Patrick Beverly does, does have a better place on this team in terms of fit. But Caruso, I definitely miss. I mean, there were a lot of like deep like metric numbers out that, that says like, hey, you put like I don't know these all the fancy numbers that are that are there. They were like, hey, uh, the metrics show the numbers show that offensive efficiency when LeBron and Caruso are together are the best of any duo on that team. Sometimes better than LeBron and AD on the court together. So they're all the numbers sort of worked out you know so he could close games with LeBron or he could yeah he could run the second team as well or you know or it would be like LeBron in the second team would be with Caruso and that would work out well I mean spacing and fit are just so important in the NBA That the autograph's a little early for the autograph. Let's set that right there. I don't know. I mean, we saw that with Westbrook, too. There's Luca Garza, 2 out of 39. That'll be for Detroit. That's going to be for Sean Maddock. There's Franz Wagner, 46 out of 79. Part of that, uh, part of that young Orlando team that could get really good really fast. Matthew with the magic. Ooh, saw some green. Well, there's lime green. Maybe not a uh, a train whistle green. Maybe there's a train whistle green in there somewhere. So Franz Wagner, Jalen Suggs, among others on that team, could get good really fast. There he is again. There's Chris Middleton Lime Green to 149. Yeah, Mo Bamba does get minutes. I think he's had a really big, uh, big step forward this past season. If I'm not, if, unless I'm mistaken, I'm pretty sure he did. 
Man, what, what I would wish for him to... But he, I mean, even if he does return to form, that might not be to the benefit of the, the team. I don't, know if, I don't know if he fits too well, but I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We'll see what new coach Darvin Ham can do. Maybe he'll work wonders. Davion Mitchell at Trey Mann also not too shabby as well. Hollow for OKC, Sean Maddock. We got a second year Orange Lamella, 132 out of 199. And another Evan Mobley rated rookie. No, no parallel on this one, but at least you got a few of those. All right, let's see what that autograph is about. All right, Derek White, Clint Capella, and Herbert Jones, rated rookie. On-card autograph for Matthew and the Pelicans. A little bit, I don't know what those indents are, but it almost as if Herbert Jones put a piece of paper over this and then wrote something on pen. Come on, Herbert. Yeah, he actually, Thibaut thinks that Jones is going to be a good player. He actually, and there's Embiid right here, he got some minutes in the playoffs with the Pelicans last year. And I feel like in what limited time he got, he was pretty pretty decent, I want to say. If not, like, eye-openingly good for a young player like him. So who knows? That might be, that might be a little bit of a sleeper there. All right, didn't see any of the big names, but maybe in there in that final third of this case. Um, there's the dice roll, one dice roll for both lists. There's the left-right randomizers for those all-star cards, and then the numbered one. That was 32 out of 49. That was Dirk Nowitzki, Dallas, and D. Wade, Miami. Just check and see if maybe sometimes someone might have the same teams. No. Matthew has the Mavs and Sean Maddock has the Heat. All right. Let's roll it, randomize it. Four and a four, eight the hard way. We'll do left, right first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. So all the right side cards, we'll get those, uh, those all-star cards right there. That one's numbered. So we'll go eight times for Dallas, Miami. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. After eight, goes to Miami. That'll be for Sean Maddock. You'll get the 32 out of 49 blue parallel. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. And we'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.